Lauren Smith, and I'm from Olivia Wade, and we are from Girl Scout Troop 65294, and we're working on our Bronze Award, which is focusing on the dangers of distracted driving in our community. We are working hard to educate people of the dangers of distracted driving and help them change behaviors to make them more attentive when behind the wheel. Um, our project rolls out in April, which is Distracted Driving Month. You can find details of our project in the handouts we gave you, but some highlights include... We are performing research at various traffic areas in town to observe drivers, making note of how many are distracted and the various distractions, phone, eating, reading, etc. Um, we will be creating flyers to be distributed in businesses in town to raise awareness of distracted driving. We will be having a booth at the high school in Fruit Street Field, encouraging drivers to sign the pledge to not be a distracted driver. In exchange for signing the pledge, the drivers will receive education materials on the dangers of distracted driving. A silicone bracelet with one of our two slogans, tenants who keep the road in view and behind the wheel focus on driving, that's all. A transparent window sticker for their car and our gratitude for helping us make our community safer. Uh, we want to produce road signage that will be placed in various locations in town, like traffic lights, school exits, etc., reminding drivers to focus on driving and not to be distracted. To move this piece of the project forward, we need your help. We need to understand the parameters for creating such signs, understand the process for approval, determine the locations, and who to work with on the board of selectmen. We will fund the productions of the signs and will work with the DPW on having the signs erected at the designated locations. Thank you for your time and your support as we tackle this important issue and make Hockington a safer place. We welcome any questions that you might have about our project. Excellent presentation. Thank you very much. Well done. So take a minute and look up on the TV there. You'll see yourselves on TV. We're going to put you right there. Just wave to the crowd. Say hi to everybody at home that's watching. You'd be surprised how many people watch this stuff. Um, so great presentation. And what I'd like to do, although we don't typically kind of go back and forth in the public forum section uh, of our meeting uh, or have any debate, I'd like to uh, open it up to the board to have it, answer any questions they may have and perhaps offer some suggestions about some of their questions. Mr. Sestari, you want to begin? Um, sure. I just want to, I want to say what a great idea this is. And uh, it's great that we have another group, yet another group, of uh, young citizens in our town who care about the town so much that they're actually being active and trying to help out. Uh, so I certainly support this effort 100%. I'm not sure if I'm uh, the right person to help out with sign design, but I'm sure that the board as a whole can either help you directly or point you in the right direction with someone who, uh, who will help you. We are likely going to delegate that to one of the folks that we work with. So um, hang in there and we'll get you a name here in a few minutes. Mr. Coutinho. Uh, this is great. You know, we, we, we've had Girl Scouts come here with the, with the, the uh, gold awards. Silver. Silver, yep. silver and gold. Yep, yep. So how many are involved with the, with the bronze award? Is it a whole troop um, thing or is it, it's, is it individual like the, like the gold award? It's a whole troop. Ten girls in our troop are all working on this project. Excellent. Excellent. It's great because you know you have to delegate the work and spread it all out to make sure it's all even and everything. That's great. I know you guys and you're doing a great job. Thanks for coming. Thanks for speaking up. It's it's an important thing. Mr. Tedstone. Well, thank you for coming and you guys did a great job. <clears throat> this can't be very easy for you to come up here and read into a microphone knowing that you're on television with a room full of people that don't know you. So you've done a wonderful job and your voice was not cracking. You did a great job. You should be very proud of yourself for that. And uh, much like Mr. Sestari said, I back you guys 100% and if there's anything that we can do, please let us know. We're glad to help you guys out. First off, Elaine Lazarus. I knew that one was coming. <laughs> she will work with you uh, in linking you with the appropriate town departments to help you along. Uh, for example, we may have, and this is what happens when you work with government, we may have regulations regarding the size of the signage. And there may be permits that are required in terms of where you actually locate the signage. We really want to help you. 
We want to make the process easy for you. Okay, we have a motion and a second to waive the fees for permits or anything that I like that the town would typically impose. Mr. Kamal, are you okay with that motion? Yes. Mrs. Lazarus, okay. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? It is unanimous and so carries. Okay, ladies, thank you very much for coming tonight. You've got the green light to make our roads safer, and we look forward to your signs getting out in Hopkinton. Can we call you back for the traffic calming stuff that we, we were looking at at EHOP a couple of last week? <laughs> and cookies.